cheap homestead mechanic here. Now, I got a different view as of Tuesday. Uh, one of my chicken tractors that we just got done building. It's uh, three, candle, three cattle panels wide. And as of right now, um, I found some improvements I got to do. Um, I'm out here with these little guys. We just had a major storm come through. And um, as you can see, yeah, there's a heater out here. Normally, I have these two lights up for them. But, just happened to uh, go to the kitchen to finish up dinner. And all of a sudden I look out my back window and I see this flopping in the wind. And you can see right there, looks like a line. I got some paracord up there which I'll be putting some more and then I also threw another tarp over originally because you can see these guys aren't feathered up feathered all the way out I had the back blocked a little bit you can see the ventilation holes side blocked and that side open Get some air through here, minus this, this heater. But I get these guys, you can size, tell they're all dark. And we just had a big storm go through here with about probably 40, maybe 50 mile an hour winds. So, I don't know what you all are doing on Tuesday afternoon, but this is what I'm doing. Trying to get these guys back to doing this or even though we just got flooded this or this right here Mr. Hot Stuff over here along with his buddy normally they're out in here flying around that one feeder got a little wet so that's why they're over there on the ground pecking Everybody else over here is getting warm back up, trying to get back to normal. So, as far as some improvements on my chicken tractor I have here, which is basically, like I was stated, three cattle panels. We are at, oh, if I remember correctly, 50 inches. Um, I'll share some steps on another one that I need to get together here. Uh, we do have chicken wire. I don't know if you can see it again. Hopefully you can see that. On the back side as well. And top. I used all 2 by 6 This is all reclaimed stuff. Except for the cattle panels. Um, and then on my corner braces. Uh, I used some bookshelf angles. So that way if I gotta slide it and this thing don't shift around and get all kitty wonk on me. Um I also do have another tarp over. There's a tan one over top of this now. Um and I got rocks on this side over here. Along with a couple other things when I when I was cleaning up, I got uh, you can see one shadow over there, a ring. It's chicken tractor tires leaning up on there to hold this tarp down so some improvements so if anybody does their tractor um, go ahead and get yourself some paracord or uh, um, brain fog here guys sorry uh, get yourself some uh, clothesline um, to hold your tarps down and I did have the side screwed and All this up here was all screwed and zip-tied 
and with this wind coming through it just it just took this thing and <laughs> pulled it like it was nothing so um like i said i will be doing some other improvements at one time i thought about i may still try it um i might end up after this ordeal here in the future uh building some permanent structures or whatever uh for these guys uh as far as meat bird production here or whatever that's what these these are cornish rocks um so anyways i'm out here what i'm going to show you as and i've gotten very very lucky i consider myself out of these guys a bunch of these were pretty rough looking when i flew out here and pulled everything and started panicking and but anyways what i'm going to show you and that was the result of all the weather so i guess out of that i can consider myself very lucky so anyways I just figured I'd share some stuff what uh, you, you can expect um, if you want to do an outside tractor. I'm not saying it's going to happen to everybody. But if you do have yourself some extra screws, nails, wire, tarps, paracord, clothesline, sheeting, on hand... That way, if you have to, board something up, cover something up, you're not trying to, I mean, you're already trying to scramble as it is, but you're trying to get everything, everybody back under cover, and back to, as you can see, some of them are getting a little more rambunctious again enjoying themselves so all right this is part of my my one of my days so um cheaper homestead mechanic out